Hey guys, I'm back with another video. Uh, and last video we had the to take on the 49ers. If you haven't seen that already, go back to that video before you watch this one. But um, we, I see that we have a tandem breakout. So hopefully it's one of our good players that we have. We don't really have a lot of the rookies. Um, it's Dante Jackson, it says Van Ginkle, sometimes it works out, don't let it discourage you, so Dante Jackson is having a breakout, I guess, is that's what it's saying, I guess that's what it's saying, crisis and confidence, really? We're doing good so far. We're three and two or four and two. Or something like that. So I don't know why they don't have confidence. Justin Jefferson on strange again. Uh woke up feeling like a different player today. Helping the team that was huge. Have to hear you and Tyree Kill. Is great spirits after this game. Has earned two thousand five hundred XP. Nice. I mean, I don't know what it does for them, but nice. So, yeah, let's go to the next week. Um, so, yeah. Um, comment down below uh, how you guys are feeling. And by the way, this is number eight in the series. We have upgrades, which is really good. Justin Jefferson. Um, honestly, that's really good. I kind of want him... To have, mm -hmm. Hmm, let's see. I kind of want him to be a deep threat. So when like Tyreek Kill retires or something in the future, because we're gonna go on for the whole year, for the rest of the year, this like actual year, and we're probably gonna do like five or six seasons, and maybe Tyreek Kill retires at that point. Um, we're facing the one in five Bengals. Um, and last night, um, cause I recorded it last night. I did a trade. Uh, I am actually kind of happy about, um, I got Jerry Judy. I don't think I posted anything on it, but I put him at half back because I knew that Tony Pollard was okay, but I also liked using Jerry Judy as a uh, running back because he's an 87, but he can go up to a 99, which is really good. And we already have Derrick Henry, but I didn't know he was going to be back that soon. So, yeah, I traded away, um, like, a few guys. So, when Odell Beckham comes back, we're going to have him gonna be really old that's the only problem we have there and I traded away some draft picks not anything like that just like some so now um now I'm talking to you guys uh, hey guys today's been fun and comment down below if it was a good trade I think I just said that. I don't know. I have a pretty bad memory. But you see that team right there? I hope we win. Um, so last video, we uh, you saw the San Francisco 49ers have their playbook. Honestly, I was going into the, um, the practice mode. And I actually liked the formations, the formations and stuff. So, I was like, let's use that. Um, so, yeah. Now, we're going to use that. Ooh, that's sick. So, we have that. Um, yeah, how you guys days been going? That's what I'm wondering. My day's been going pretty good. I just woke up as well, so good um but yeah if you like the videos like and comment how you guys days been going
So now we are starting still. Still. And the kick is off to Duvernay. Uh, Duvernay in real life is actually good because if you guys haven't seen the clip of him getting a uh, 103 yard kick return, it's absolutely nuts. Just breaks tackles. We have Jordan Hicks right here as our starting middle linebacker. He was right there, and that's DJ Moore. They have Kirk Cousins as their quarterback. DeAndre Swift is their running back. Ooh, and Duvernay gets absolutely bopped by Andre Sisko. Is a first and ten now. I just got absolutely torched by DJ Moore on Horn. Oh my gosh. DJ Moore just torched JC Horn. I want to actually see that real quick. Let's see. What even happened? JC Horn's. Oh. Well, I don't know. He just like stopped. He like gets caught up, and then I take over and. Somehow he still doesn't get them. Okay, but now they're up six nothing. About to be seven. So seven nothing now. That was an absolutely beautiful pass by Kirk Cousins. So this game's gonna be fun. Oof. So now we have punt returning is bored. It is going to be a first and ten for two attack of Iloa and the Falcons. Um, so let's see how this goes. They have Nick Bosa. I'm not going to run it to that side because I know our offensive line is not going to hold up that good against him. And that was a two yard loss. I'm pretty sure. Dr. Jackson out for the game. Aaron Jones out for the season and Oda Beckham. So. That is going to suck for us. That's why he wasn't doing very good. That's why J.C. Horn wasn't super good. I kind of do want to go on Nick, Nick, Nick Bosa's side. So it's a third and seven now. That was a three-yard uh, get. By. He got three yards. That's what I was trying to say. It's a fourth and seven now. That was Nick Bosa in there for almost a sack. Pressure. Jordan Hicks with the boom on them. On Duvernay. It is 7 nothing. The defense for them is pretty good. Javon Holland is their sub linebacker. And you know how I traded for him early this season? Well, now we have Justin Simmons. And I was thinking we could keep him as our sub linebacker. Or we could trade him away. Closer to the draft time for draft picks, honestly. Because we're not going to need them if we have Justin Simmons, but. And we could trade them away for like first rounds and basically all that kind of stuff. That's DJ Moore on the end of round. On DJ Moore.
And JC Horn's not there. He, I clicked on to try to get the ball, but it's definitely not there. In real life, that should be a pick. Bro, he just moshed him. Are you joking? That's so stupid. Okay, I need to do something about the cornerback situation. Our cornerbacks are terrible right now. They're getting mossed. So let's go into um let's go into the cornerback place. I wanna put let's put in Javon Holland at our third string. Or the second string. No, let's put Horn. Denzel Ward, then Horn, then Javon Holland. Just so we can have him not get burned. And then if we need it, Andre Sisko can be our fourth string. Then we got Trey Herndon. Let's put Trey Herndon actually there. So, now we're good. Um, I just needed to do that so that we don't get absolutely torched. Like we've been doing. We've been getting. DeAndre Swift with the Swift moves. Haha. <laughs> That's not really that funny, but it's a first and ten for them. Right there for the tackle, Devon Holland. Ron Holland with the tackle for the last play of the first quarter. I need to switch up something for our sub linebacker because it's not putting him. I want to put. Let's actually put um, Andre Cisco there at sub linebacker. I like putting him there. So yeah. So now our now our. Third and and two. Um. Picked off by Andre Cisco, the guy that I just put at sub linebacker, gets the pick. It's picked off by Andre Cisco with the amazing pick. It is a first and ten now. And that was a first and ten. That was picked off by Jackson, Kareem Jackson. Now at the 46 is the Bengals. Bengals. We only have nine yards this game. We got Javon Holland on DJ Moore. Getting torched by DJ Moore. So I'm gonna have to be Justin Simmons watching on Javon Holland, like with Javon Holland. He was literally right there, Jordan Hicks, but he couldn't get off the block because he was holding him too much. And that was Javon Holland with the tackle. I said Javon Holland a lot of times. And that was a stop. That was a stop by our defense.
kicked off Justin Simmons with his first of the game. That was Justin Simmons with the with the interception. His first of the season. He was one of our he was like the fifth pick that we had. We picked him up. That was an amazing interception. And it's clutch. That was clutch right there. Come on, Derek. Derek Henry's not playing very good. Second and seven now. It's a two minute warning now in the second quarter. Seven nothing is the score. Bengals winning. And Thompson tries to bring him down, but he doesn't. He's unable to. That's picked off. That's another pick by Tua. Kyle Fuller now, or Kendall. No idea which one it is. I should have just ran it or something. And that's a sack on Yamada in there for the sack. David on Yamada. It's a nice name right there. Horn is on more. Picked off JC Horn. That's the first interception of J.C. Horn this game. Trying to put uh, Jerry Judy in there for his first touch of the game. Okay, well, that didn't work. Need an outside run with him. Okay, well, that didn't work either. There is 40 seconds left. Third and 13. Fourth and 13 now. J.C. Horn with the big boom right there on DuVernay. Almost picked off by Van Ginkle. Or Colt Holcomb, I mean. Sorry. They kind of look the same. Not very much, but it's close. It was a second and ten now. A third and ten now. Kirk Cousins falling under. Got him before it. Fourth and one. Fourth and one. Gonna punt it with three seconds left. So that will be the first half. Now the second half. 
where the Falcons are looking to score, but we get ball first. Stout kicking it off. And that was bored getting up to the 30. That was a two yard gain. Second and eight. And that was a flag. A holding. It's an offensive holding. Now that we're going to be at the 22. It's a second and 18. Let's, that was Johnny Smith for the third and 11. We have Tyreek Hill press one on one just in case he's not open. One on one, more like just everyone's on him. Fourth and eleven now for the Falcons. He literally just overshot. That's not even the right guy. I was trying to. I know, comment down below that I did the wrong guy. That was my fault, for sure. I was on Onyemata and I was right there, but DJ Moore is just so fast. That is Tyler Higby on the catch. First and ten for the Bengals. That is Jordan Hicks with the tackle. They stop him at the goal line. First and goal now. That is a touchdown. 14 nothing now. Fourteen nothing is a score for the Bengals. And Bengals kicking off to CJ Board. So now it is a first and ten. That's Henry with the three yard game. That's Henry running down to at the forty to about the forty.
They call that a fumble? What? They're not gonna re they're not gonna challenge it? They can't Bro, that's so stupid. Time out. Let me instantly play that. Really? That was a fumble? His arm was going back. He hit the So basically this game's probably over. Denzel Ward is just getting burned every single play. We can't do anything against them except maybe try this. Kirk Cousins throws it again. And it is a first and, or second and, and two, uh, five, second and five. Bro, come on! That's so dumb. It's a first and ten for the Bengals. Fourth quarter now. This game's not doing good. We're not doing good at all. <sighs> okay. Second goal now. Wide open hole, really? Bruh, that's so dumb. I, uh, I sent a blitz, and somehow they still don't get in there. Gosh, that's so dumb. Carla Taffis. Carla Taffis. Having all these key players gone just damages our team. Our pain is just getting absolutely destroyed. So... I'm gonna just sim ahead. I'm gonna just play the rest of the game out. And yeah, I'll see. I'll see. You.